Welcome to the Singapore National Eye Centre. For patients who are here for a LASIK assessment, you could go through a range of tests. LASIK is a type of laser vision correction for myopia, hyperopia and astigmatism. The visual equity test is used to determine how well a person can see. It tests a person's ability to read the smallest letters on a standard chart called the Snellen chart, held 6 meters away. People with poor vision will not be able to read the smaller letters. Tonometry test The tonometry test measures the intracular pressure or internal pressure of the eye. It is used as one of the screening tools for diseases like glaucoma. Patients undergoing the test will be asked to look into a machine called a tonometer where they will experience a brief puff of air in the eye. At the end of the test, a printout of the test results will be generated. Opscan The Opscan is a test that helps to evaluate whether a patient is suitable for the LASIK procedure. It gives the doctor detailed information on parameters such as the corneal curvature and corneal thickness of the patient's eye. The patient will be asked to sit in front of a machine and keep his eyes open and focus for approximately 3-4 to four seconds at a fixation light. The test takes about 4-5 to five minutes to complete. Refraction Test a refraction test is used to determine the spectacle power. During refraction, an optometrist puts an instrument called a trial frame in front of the patient's eyes, together with a series of lenses of various powers. The patient's vision is then tested with these lenses. The optometrist will continue to fine-tune the lens power until the vision is clearest. The lenses with which this level of vision is achieved is the spectacle power of the eye. Refraction determines the degree of far-sightedness, short-sightedness, astigmatism, and presbyopia. The test takes about 10 to 20 minutes to complete. Sleep lamp examination. The sleep lamp is used to examine the front of the eye. It allows the eye specialist to have a highly magnified view of the eye structure to evaluate the eye health and detect any signs of infection or disease. The patient will be asked to place his chin on the chin rest and the eye specialist will direct the light onto the eye to examine various parts of the eye. A range of eye conditions can be detected with sleep lamp examination including cataract and cornea ulcers. Dilation of the eye Dilation of the eye is necessary for the eye specialist to examine the optic nerve at the back of the eye, as well as to determine if there are retinal diseases. Eye drops will be applied to enlarge or dilate the pupil. About 30 minutes is required for the eye drops to take effect. The eye specialist will then use an instrument known as the ophthalmoscope to examine the eye. Patients may experience blurred vision after the dilation for up to 4 hours. Some may experience glare in daylight, and in these instances, wearing sunglasses may help to minimise this. With the test results, you will need to consult the doctor again. The doctor will advise on your suitability for the LASIK procedure and may set a date for the surgery.